Good morning, and welcome to Wednesday Morning Prayer with St. Ignatius from the Fordham Preparatory School Chapel. For this morning's prayer, we will focus on the virtue of gratitude. St. Ignatius said, The greatest sin is ingratitude. It is the cause, beginning, and origin of all evils and sins. By emphasizing gratitude, Ignatius was saying something about the nature of God. God is the generous giver, showering us with blessings. If we truly understood this, we would return God's love with love. We wouldn't sin. Gratitude is a good word for this fundamental quality of our relationship with God. Ingratitude, our blindness to who God truly is, is thus the root of all sin. The second step of the Ignatian examen is giving thanks. For Ignatius, gratitude is the first, most important step on the spiritual journey. An attitude of gratitude practiced often helps us find God in all things and can transform the way we look at our life and other people. And so we begin our prayer on gratitude this morning by praying for the grace we seek. And so I pray now for the following graces. Wonder at God's ongoing creation. Gratitude for the gift of God creating me and creating the world. I begin my reflection on gratitude by reviewing the past days and naming the blessings from the most significant and obvious to the more common and ordinary. God is found in the details, so be very specific. As you take stock of these days, honor the gifts of others in your life but don't forget to recognize the gifts in you, for they too are God-given. Don't feel that you must mechanically go through the days hour by hour or make a list of all the day's gifts. Instead, savor whatever gifts God shows you. With God's gentle guidance, let the days go through you. Listen prayerfully now to Psalm 100 and ask yourself, what am I thankful for? A song of ascents. I raise my eyes toward the mountains. From whence shall come my help? My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. He will not allow your foot to slip or your guardian to sleep. Behold, the guardian of Israel never slumbers nor sleeps. The Lord is your guardian. The Lord is your shade at your right hand. By day the sun will not strike you, nor the moon by night. The Lord will guard you from all evil. He will guard your soul. The Lord will guard your coming and going, both now and forever.
and we close our prayer in gratitude as we pray in the words Jesus gave us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Have a blessed day.